We've recently done a number of videos for Holford Engineering. They've got a fantastic machine shop, milling and turning. But Steve wanted to share with us one of the projects they've recently been involved in. So we have been invited to the Cardington Air Hangers in Bedfordshire. As you can see, I'm now inside the hangar with Steve from Holford Engineering and behind me, the Airlander 10 Airship, the world's biggest aircraft. Now, your involvement with this project, Steve, Triple M? The Triple M, which is a mobile mooring mast, um, essentially is a modified vehicle um, that's been bought off the shelf and it's been modified to add weight and, to, uh, and been developed to be able to moor the, the Airlander 10 vehicle. Okay, so what's your actual involvement in this project? The, the involvement has been working closely with the design team, with the project guys, um, producing components from the ground up. Essentially the vehicle was stripped and then it's been built up from the ground up, including the, the large bottom plate which is 2.6 tonne, as well as the other plates and the inner and outer mast unit, as well as the top, top socket itself. Okay, so look at the components. You said they're 2.6 tonnes? Yes, the bottom plate, the, the initial component we produced, um, weighed 2.6 tonnes when, when it was complete. Uh, and then from that, it's been built up with various components. Okay, the, and that component itself, which machine was that manufactured on? The large, large components been produced on the Mazat VTC 800s. Uh, the top component, the rain components, have been produced on the DSG lathe. Very impressive stuff. And why were Holford engaged in this project? Because of our ability to produce large components, working closely with a design team, so there's been some project, project management going on there, some uh, engineering work going on, and, and we're obviously local. So really you've been able to provide a solution with the equipment you've got at your machine shop? That's correct, yes, yes. Fantastic piece of equipment, not only that, but the Airlander 10 in the background, we look forward to seeing its first flight. Yes, great.